Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills. Guys, I have some iced tea coming from Salt Lake City. But before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Do it right now. It really helps me a lot. Well, guy, Heather Gay has been talking about her experience filming The Real Housewives of Salt Lake City and how it really helped her to found herself again. <sighs> Okay, so this is the thing. You know that she used to be this huge Mormon. Uh, you know that Mormons are not able to get divorced. It's against the law or God or whatever. I don't know. The thing is that they're not supposed to do it. Uh, she got married with this guy who she wasn't even in love. It, I think it was, I mean, anything, no. it was an arranged marriage, but she wasn't in love. They have kids. How weird it should be for you to know that your mom doesn't love your father when they had you basically your father raped your mom kind of thing <laughs> so um i don't know i mean that that should be so weird so basically she is saying that um filming helped her uh because they separated nine years ago and they have been officially divorced five years are old but she said that it's still fresh okay sonia morgan uh she says that for a long time she was barely able to say the the word ex-husband or the word that she uh, or, or say that she was divorced but with filming she finally found herself being independent it was a liberating experience it was a healing process for her and now that and now she can even say that she has an ex-husband or that she is divorced without trembling all the time um, she is going around and saying that uh, that one of the real reasons that this uh, was big for her and how she decided to finally get divorced, it was the moment that she was looking at her daughters and realizing that the example that she was putting out there for them, for for them, uh, it was completely different to what she actually wanted to give them. You know, um, you know, these Mormons, uh, they think that everything needs to be perfect. And, you know, I'm guessing they are misogynistic AF, you know, and like women can't do anything and blah, 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 you know, and like they are just, I'm guessing, to reproductive purposes. And finally, she says, like, well, this is not perfect. I'm endorsing something that I don't believe. So she just. I mean, she, she, that was the moment that she realized I do need to divorce because I don't want my daughters to go through the same thing that I went through. However, you know, especially if you are on these big relations or cults, like they really brainwash you, you know, so it's very hard to just go out there and go back to regular life after your whole life, since you were little, you were like, brainwash to be this robot step for wife um so the only thing that i can say about this is i applaud her for you know finding her voice for you know be an actual example to her daughters you know that her daughters look at her and being like you know what i can be a strong independent woman i do not i do not need to go through this path of weirdness i don't know like this is insane I, I i cannot believe that these religions still exist honestly so yeah that's what she's saying uh filming was very good for her because she she finally found herself uh for the first time because she said that she grew up being like this so she has never been able to really open her mind to say oh my god there is another world out there when i don't have to be this slave you know so this was amazing for her and i congratulate her for being where she is on this journey that she is going um that's it guys that's the ic that i have for you so let me know what you guys think on the comments below are you liking are you liking heather what do you think of her storyline are you proud of her let me know and don't forget to like this video share this video overall subscribe to my channel guys and don't forget december 28th we have the first housewife hunger games go apply right now and don't miss on the chance to win 300 dollars and i'll see you around see ya